The other big story this morning, that massive and deadly wildfire raging in Washington state, exploding in size over the weekend. This new drone footage shows the devastation. Entire towns destroyed, hundreds of homes scorched. ABC's Brandy Hitt is on the front lines for us there in Pateros, Washington. Good morning, Brandy. Good morning, Robin. This is the devastation many families are returning home to. All that's left here are concrete walls. Now, this has been one intense firefight, but this morning, calmer winds are finally giving firefighters the break they've been waiting for. Surrounded by heavy smoke, this morning the National Guard is running a race against time, hoping to douse these fast-moving flames spreading across Washington state. Between Mother Nature with everything going on in the region, uh, it's very challenging. This newly released video taken by drone captures entire neighborhoods now reduced to ash, the blaze destroying homes. It sounded like a roaring train, and it was coming in funnels like a storm. Mountainsides turned to barren wastelands. What began last Monday as four separate fires sparked by lightning exploded 10 times over on Friday and is now one massive inferno, torching more than 230,000 acres and burning up to 200 homes. Front door, living room. Including Warren Smethers' dream house that he purchased just three weeks ago. 90% of everything moved in and lost it. And even claiming the life of one 67-year-old man who died trying to protect his home. During the fire, he got a, had a heart attack yesterday and died. Crews are creating critical fire perimeters to stop the now the more than 370 square miles of flames. This is a firestorm beyond human imagination, and we need more assets. Now, even though conditions have improved, hundreds of homes remain evacuated this morning. These families relying heavily on each other for a lot of strength and support right now, Robin. They're definitely in our thoughts, Brandy. Thank you.